2010 Freedom Gardening Seed Bank. This is the top of the peace sign. That's the sign I used to find the center of this hill last year. This is the center stripe. Goes right down the middle. Overlooks the beautiful historic town of Johnsonburg. So here's the center got the right arm, the center arm, the left arm, and then up the center. This symbol was actually as a nuclear disarmament symbol way back. It's taken on many meanings, but to me it means peace, love, unity, prosperity for all. We have been sprinkling boxes and boxes of seeds all through here. You can see them laying on the ground there. There are a few sprouts coming up. They're real tiny. There's one. There's another one. You see a couple squash seeds. Put a lot of black seeded lettuce, Simpson lettuce. A lot of bright yellow flowers. I can't even begin to talk about the different varieties. Sunflowers, Coreopsis, Shasta daisies, the yellow daisies. You go on and on and on. There's so many different varieties in here. It's real rocky soil as you can see where I mowed. It kind of turned into mulch. Up here beyond these tree lines are two big lakes. Ponds. We're going to try and figure out how to run irrigation from there over to here. Probably inject it with a little bit of fertilizer to help these guys along. And they're starting. They're really hard to see. They're extremely small. A lot of these little annuals start out and they're like the size of a hair. So this is the peace sign. It's the 23rd of June. It's been planted. Now we need to fertilize. I'm going to go back and weed whack the outline of the entire ring inside and out. And then we're going to come into these patches and shave the inside of those and plant those with blue flax. We're going for blue and gold for the peace. Multicolored down below on the hill for the love. And then over here where that little bush is, that is the top of the cross. Again, that was planted with multiple colored pink, purple, blue, and different varieties that should bloom different times of the year. Again, this is really rocky clay dirt. There is the cross. And over here is the L for the love. It's about 15 feet long and about 10 feet wide. Again, this was all planted with different kinds of wildflowers. All done with a weed whacker and a rope. The O, very simple. Put a stake in the middle with the string. Ran the string out here and walked in a circle. Made the O. Same with the O for the peace sign. Here's the V. And the E was tough because this is all rocks. And then over here, barely visible, I put a smiley face. There is the big mouth, and there is an eye, and another eye. This is the peace sign overlooking Johnsonburg. Happy birthday, 2010. It's awesome.